Hey everyone, this is WaywardWin911. Welcome back to Let's Play Kingdom Hearts Final Mix. In the last episode, we took out Jafar after... Oh my god, how long? Jesus Christ, that battle was fucking terrible. Anywho, let's go to the keyhole. And Jasmine. We need to save her too. Genie! My final wish! Oh, bullshit. I want you to make me an all-powerful genie! No, Robin Williams! I don't know why I made that a thing. I just did. Anyway, ah, shit. This isn't good. This is not good. Can we do... Let's see. I think she's only passed out. We gotta go after Jafar first. And why can't we seal this right now? Why, why not? Why not? Anywho, before we jump in there and go after Jafar, who presumably went down there, I want to see if I can go and save. Because... Yeah, no, I can't save. Fuck. Okay, let's jump down. Holy shit, lava. Ah, uh, you thought the first battle was going? Well, guess what? Now we're finding Genie Jafar. The lamp. Get Jafar's lamp. So, the whole target of this battle is not Jafar, it's Siago. Thanks, Donald. Oh, how generous. Anyway, this is how you dwindle down his health. For some reason. Oh, shit. Ow! That actually didn't hurt that much. Oh, what, 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 what? Why can't I move? Ah! My controller disconnected! Fuck you, controller. No reaction commands. Sonic Blade will not work here. Anyway, Yago seems to be letting us go easy. Look at this! I think gravity would work. <laughs> Ow. Uh, let's get back up there. <laughs> Iago, stand still. Oh, shit. So, we just want to mash this. Ah, I don't have, I don't, I can't jump that high. Well, thanks to this elevated platform, I sort of can, but... No, that isn't the permanent solution! Why why the hell am I tilting my own body to hit him? I swear. That's sort of a thing with gamers. <laughs> boom, 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 boom! Overkill! On a fucking lamp! No, no, I can't reach you. Damn. Oh shit! Thank you, Arrow. I'm gonna cast that again. <laughs> Come on, Donald, Goofy, where are you? Shiza, no, no! Get down here! Ah, one thing's for sure. This isn't dragging out as much as the last battle was. Come on, Iago. Get over here! Uh, 
still can't jump that high. If only. If only. I'm just gonna play it safe by casting arrow on myself one more time, then going in for this kill. No! 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 I said go in for the kill! Uh, yeah! And we won after the first try. <laughs> you know, I blame my defeat the first time on the Jafar and Genie fight on the Blizzard attack. Okay, Jafar, back to your lamp. Oh yeah, he is a genie, so he has—he's subject to the will of the master of the lamp. Now, throw it in the lava! And, we get our fire upgrade as well! Fire has been upgraded to fire, and we get Ants- uh, Excuse me! We get Ansem's Report 1. Meanwhile... <gasps> ah, shit. Jasmine? Jasmine! Oh, there's the keyhole. And now we can un now we can lock it. Don't know what the problem was be before. Why couldn't we do it then? Yeah. Oh well. Okay, and we just sealed the keyhole and turned the door into gold dust, apparently. But then it just seals off. Did anyone else hear that? Oh shit. Whoa, we better get out of here! Jasmine! Nope, Aladdin, she's not here. Alright, and this is a bullshit flying segment. Huzzah. Ow. Now you can still swing your keyblade, so use that to your advantage and fly through. But you cannot cure, so... Yeah. That can be a bit troublesome. I'd say. At least you at least you only really need to control your position on the x-axis. Ow. Ow. Oh shit. Oh, that didn't go well. But hey, we got out anyway. Why? Plot convenience. <laughs> Uh. So, Jasmine's no longer in Agrabah. Sora, let's go find her. Sorry, I can't take you with me. W why not? I sure wish we could, but we can't. If we take him to another world, we would be mut mut meddling. Aladdin, I promise we'll find Jasmine, I promise. Uh, Earth to Al. Hello, you still have one wish left? Look, just say the word. Ask me to find Jasmine for you. I... I wish for your freedom, Genie. Ow! Ah, nice guys keep their promises. Hey! Oh look, legs. And no a more a deal, Genie. wristbands. Now you can go anywhere you want. You're your own master. But if you can, it'd be great if you could go along with them and help Sora find Jasmine. Hmm. Sorry, Al. I'm done taking orders from others. But... Genie. 
A favor? Now that's entirely different. I guess I could give that a try. After all, we're pals, right, Al? Genie. Just leave it to me! <laughs> crappy transitions are crappy. Anyway. Low time! My god, they're so fucking noticeable. <sighs> and that smarmy vizier could have had him. If someone had stuck around to give him a hand. Hey, I did my part. I brought the princess, didn't I? Jafar was beyond help, consumed by his own hatred. One should beware of letting it burn too fiercely. Whoa, 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 lighten up. Uh, I'm as cool as they come, okay? By the way, kid, have we got something special for you. Huh? We had a deal, yes. You help us, and we grant you your wish. Kyrie. Kyrie, go to her. Your vessel is waiting. Just remember, this is no pleasure cruise. It won't be a pleasant voyage. Why are you doing all this for me? What's the catch? Cat, what's the catch? Silly boy. You're like a son to me. I only want you to be happy. I seriously doubt that. Believe what you wish. But lest we forget, I kept my end of the bargain. Default face. So terrible. I don't like those default faces. <clears throat> Excuse me. Keep getting phlegm in my throat. But yeah, Riku is in league with the yeah, the bad guys. I think it's official by now. Anywho, we learn to summon Genie. Here, take this with you. And we obtain the Keyblade Three Wishes. And we learn the Green Trinity. Sora, please find Jasmine for me. Alright, so now that we've gotten that taken care of, I say we head over to the gummy ship. Well, first off, we're gonna want to find us some items. Oh, trophies. <laughs> we can revisit some places and unseal more trinities. Wasn't there a trinity mark in the accessory shop? Could this torn page be from Merlin's book? Let's return to town and give it to him. Alright, so just to fill in the gap between the episode, I'm actually going to take the warp hole. Hopefully I don't get too caught up in anything. Cuz... Wait, what happens if I pause? Actually, you know what? I'm gonna abort this. Because... There's a chance of some... I'm just gonna say it now, there's a chance of something happening in the middle of the of the voyage between worlds, and I don't want it happening when I'm not ready for it yet. As in, right now. So, we need to head over to Traverse Town, and we need to make sure we get to Traverse Town. So, in we go. We're gonna want to go into the accessory shop. Ah, that music. Okay, now, Green Trinity, do you see it? Yahoo! And then we use magic to get a ladder down. What? Anyway. Now we can enter the ex the synthesis shop. 
We can use your items to make unusual items. Let us make something for you. Bring back a bunch of items from your travels. Yep, synthesis. Someday we'll make the ultimate weapon. So you can bring your I so you bring us all your items you can. That I totally read that wrong. Anywho, let's pillage their treasure chests and get Dalmatians and a Mithril Shard. The Dalmatians, technically they're the ones who stole. So I think this is completely justified. So let's synthesize. Oh hey, this this seems really awesome. Too bad I don't have anything for it. Anywho. Let's synthesize this, synthesize this, just one of each, it's fine. Power chain. And yeah, now we're gonna want more frost shards and thunder shards, so... I'll have to keep that in mind while grinding. Because though thunder, frost shards, thunder shards, fire, blaze shards, yada yada yada, they come from the color heartless. I mean, like, the red, red, red Nocturne and stuff like that. Anywho, I want to take a look at that thing. This slightly raises max HP and defense. Ah, I want to. I really want to. But, uh... But this is so... Good. And I don't have another accessory slot. Damn it. Uh, I'm gonna have to make do. What? The fire ring gives more. Uh, well, uh, uh. Look at that, the fire ring is better for defense than the energy bangle. Yeah, what a waste. But what I want is that experience earring. That seems really awesome. Look at all these things I can synthesize, uh, that I have the ability to synthesize now. Mega Ether, let's just get one of those. Because this synthesizing, it's going to be important. I do want this EXP earring. Keep saying that, but it, it, it looks really awesome. It seems really awesome. Anywho, let's drop down. And I'm going to go ahead and cut to when I get over to Merlin's house. Okay, so not much was cut, but oh well. Anywho, let's examine the book. And use our torn pages. Anyway. Alright, what have we got here? Uh, well, we can save. But, let's... I guess the only place we can go is back to Pooh's house. This is what we do, right? No, Pooh doesn't seem to be anywhere around here. I forget what I'm supposed to do. Hey, Owl, you have any ideas? Have we met before? Welcome to the Hundred Acre Wood. Okay, that doesn't explain anything. Uh... Come on. Do I have to talk to Merlin first? Oh! Tall, curious tree buzzing with bees. Take a look. Sure!
What's happening here? Hello? Is anyone there? Who said that? Oh my god, it's Piglet! What am I to do? I'm all alone. Pooh. Pooh. Where are you? It's me, Piglet. Not a good oh. idea, Sora. And especially with that creepy default face. Okay, he didn't go very far. Let's follow him. Just fuck with him. Um, he went into the bush. What? I'm so bad! I lost him. No. Oh out again. Hi there. Oh, oh dear. I was just, just, never mind. I'm sorry. Don't be scared. You're looking for Pooh, right? You know Pooh. Ah. Oh, you see, I, I have something for him. I have to take it to Pooh right away. <laughs> oh, Pooh! Well, speak of the devil, there he is. Oh, I believe I smell a delicious something. A something like honey. Pooh! Hello, Piglet. How have you been? Oh. I'm so glad to see you. I thought you'd gone away. I brought what you asked for. <laughs> Thank you, Piglet. Now I can finally have some honey. You're gonna use a Me? balloon to get but, 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 but honey. How? I shall hold on to the balloon and fly like a bee up the honey tree, see? What if you I think this is a terrible idea. Won't the bees be angry? Hmm. Oh. Oh what? If you could only chase away those bees, I'm quite certain I could get a small morsel of honey. Would you help me get some honey? Yeah, sure. Why not? What do you want, Owl? Oh, hello there, Owl. Good day, Pooh. What are you doing? Using a balloon to get some honey? Splendid idea! No! Allow me to offer a few pointers. <clears throat> now, Pooh can get honey by floating up to this tree with his balloon. The honey is inside the tree's hollows, not the beehives you see here. There's quite a lot of honey in these holes. If Pooh gets too close, the bees will come out and protect their honey. If they get Pooh, they'll pop his balloon, lock onto the bees, and swat them away. The more time Pooh has at each hollow, the more honey he can eat up. There's more honey higher up, too. If jumping from branch to branch proves difficult, try the rush command. Rush can help you catch up to poo quickly. But it isn't fully reliable. Good luck. Alright, so apparently that provides decent... Uh, where am I? Shit. No, no, get away from him. Rush. You're on the trunk! Oh my god, that's so stupid.
Let's rush. Whee! <laughs> Come at me, bro. Nope. Right. Uh. No! Okay, I'm gonna rush. Shit! Okay, there he goes falling down again. Yeah, this mini game is really simple. I I'm just doing terrible at it. <laughs> hey! Come on! Okay. Let's try getting back over to this. No! Seriously, this doesn't make sense. He is on a trunk. Why is he falling off? And why is it so fucking hard to get on top of this? Hit! Alright. No! At least I fell with him. I'm gonna suppose that the normal goal is a hundred. So, fuck. <laughs> Only 20 seconds left. And I did terrible. Oh, well, let's try defending him some more. No! No! No, oh, time. Time's up. <laughs> 69. Oh, that was yummy in my tummy. But there is room for a bit more. Oh, what? Do I have to do that again? Okay, the torn page turned into a new item. And we obtained Nature Spark. What? No, I don't want to go in there. I do believe I have another torn page, I think. No? Alright, well, Nature Spark. A gem emanating a strange vitality. Give it to the Fairy Godmother. I'll do that. It's right before this episode ends, I realize we've gone on for quite a bit. But I blame the load times. <laughs> anyway, Fairy Godmother, got something for me? I have this nature spark. You think that'd be useful? Think I should give that to you? Oh, another summon gem? Let's help this little one. Here we go. Bippity bada be. I I messed that up. <laughs> of all things, bippity bobbity boo. And we learn the summon spell, Bambi. If you find any more of these stones, bring them to me. Alright, and with that, we have three summons. So, I think that's been pretty good progress. Making this a good time to end this episode. So, this has been WaywardWin911. If you enjoyed this episode of Let's Play Kingdom Hearts Final Mix, leave a like and subscribe for more. Thanks for watching, and have a great day.